While playing Breath of the Wild, you might see hundreds of different objects grabbing your attention in the overworld, but the game is kept optimized through level of detail, a technique where large objects like the towers use different models with less polygons when viewed from far away. But even the lowest setting isn't quite fast enough for the large amounts of trees placed in the world, so the engine has one extra trick. From super far away, trees are replaced not just with low poly models, but with individual pre-rendered textures known as imposters. This allows an entire screen full of trees to be drawn with just a handful of triangles. And since these imposters are only used very far away, the images themselves don't have to be that big or that detailed. But the real trick to making these trees look good are the included normal maps, which allow the engine to take these pre-renders and change their lighting, helping them blend in no matter the time of day, the position of the sun, or even the current weather. And this trick is just one of many that helps Breath of the Wild render its large, expansive world in real time. For more deep dives into video game graphics, check out my channel.